Oh, yeah. Oh, look, there he is. Hey, I got a microphone. We have here with us Bulk and Skull. Goodbye, Doctor. Woo! From the original Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Thanks for taking the water. That's right. Make sure you pan the cameras around and film the empty room. All right, so I'm going to do this so that we can actually get to do this. Each person who's here that's not on the crew can ask only one question. I don't know if we have time for anything else. That's, that's, that's three questions. No! There are, oh, no, you guys aren't on the crew. Hey, you volunteer people back there. Are you guys okay, man? They're guarding you guys. Thanks for volunteering. You, know, you guys do a random job of crowd control. In fact, I would say they're overachievers. Like, you, uh, you, 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 you have controlled the crowd. You can't let everyone in. That's for sure. Um, so I think that the your fans have set up some villains. They're about to attack you guys. This is the this is the sixty dollar Bionicle <laughs> collection. Do you guys have like nightmares about this from working on the show? No, about we love the show. By Putty and Monster. No, because the paycheck that comes every week makes it all worth it. <laughs> like most jobs, our attitude is fairly poor until that day when the ducats drop. Okay, so... <laughs> um, let's talk about the show, and uh, let's talk about... Did you guys ever, like... I know you guys are so goofy, and... When you got casted for it, did they kind of give you a direction, or did they tell you what they wanted you to do with your character, or was that to you guys? No. It was not up to you guys? They kind of gave you a direction? Oh, I'm sorry. I've been misquoted. Yes. <laughs> it depends on who's directing. Sometimes the directors will give you a lot of freedom, but other times they make you stick strictly to a script, which is why they make that thing. Mm -hmm. That's what it's called, a script. I thought so we could color on it. <laughs> <laughs> so look, our characters were not particularly fleshed out. So we had a wide swath of what we could do. Because there was nothing for us to do. So we're like, let's do whatever we want. And they say no. And they didn't say no for a very long time, to be quite frank. So I'm not going to say to be quite frank, as, you know, quite Jason Frank. Uh, but at some point, they, they relied upon us to come up with stuff. Then they started writing, and then they started saying you can't do some of the stuff, which is kind of funny. That is true. They weren't cool with, like, jokes that were off-color. Really? Yeah, only primary colored jokes were allowed. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, yellow? Well, yes, I am. Oh. I'm a volunteer. No. Thank you for your service. <laughs> You're welcome. See, that's not a funny joke. <laughs> so, um... Wait a minute, wait a minute. You're about to get interviewed, not us. Okay, well. Cool. Are you hungover this morning? <laughs> <laughs> She's from Franklin, Kentucky. Really? She yeah. knows about bourbon. That's yes. So I, you I, cannot I, get her drunk. I love Kentucky. So these guys come to the Lexington Comic Con in my hometown. Oh, yeah. yeah. And there's a lot of Power Rangers there. There's a lot of Power Rangers. Yes. People yeah. call it the Mini Power Rangers. Club. And there's, really? a, there's a lot of Ghostbusters, too. But yeah. they're easy to outrun because of the, the homemade plywood and resin backpacks that they carry. The Ghostbusters are a big deal. In, in, uh, like Is it because the, the, it's haunted? It's haunted. Ghostbuster groups. In, yeah. Really? Yeah. 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 They they have have no, they have territories. Yeah. Sorry, we're being a little No, it's true. They, Two they Ghostbusters groups, and then they fight. They get together and they ectoplasmically fight. Well, one of the biggest Ghostbuster groups is in Western Kentucky, in the country. Oh. And the guy that ran it, he um, he passed away, but he ran it, and um, he was like one of the national Ghostbusters. Wow, so he's now a ghost. So now you know. Interesting. You well, that's, it's, I'm sorry that he passed away, but yeah. who got the who got the hearse? Who got the car? Um, so he didn't Please, we're busy in here. It's a panel discussion. <laughs> Don't laugh at us, sister. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have one of the Ghostbuster cars, but uh, the group does. Usually it's like one person in the group that has one. And they have that giant inflatable yeah. Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. Yes, the big They started one. that the second, no, third year. Those things, you've seen those things, right? The giant inflatable sculptures. All right, here's the fun part. Get in it. You can get in it? You can get in them. And if you get enough friends, you can literally walk the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man oh. down the road. So this Stay Puft yes. they're talking about is about, what, two, three stories tall? It's about 30 feet it's tall. It's huge. It's like as big right. as the one in the movie. Yeah. So. 
Yeah. So are we going to... Who Getting off topic. You were never on topic. What are you trying? We're talking about comic books and comic cons. That's not a comic book. That's a movie. Oh. But there is a comic book based on the movie. You know, it's, Ghostbuster groups are troubling because there's only, what, like five girls or five guys in the group? What do you do if you have 30 members? So, I mean, most of them are married. Oh, they're married to their counterparts? Like, they have a girl that's not in the group. <laughs> what do you, you, you mean, just to have, be inclusive and have a Yeah, like, how do you, like, hey, there's... No, no, it's like, what do you do? There's what, like, nothing. I mean, you're 20, like, hey, I'll close. be this guy, well, I'll be this guy, main thing I'll they be do is, out of guys. So the main, a lot of people actually ask this. I do Ghostbuster stuff, so I'm stay puff, oh. I'm the stay puff marshmallow girl. Stay what? puff yeah. marshmallow girl. Sure. So I that. made the costume about 12 years ago, and so I go, I, I am around with Ghostbuster groups a lot, and a lot of people don't understand that they're not just dressing up. The main thing they do is go to children's hospitals. Yeah, oh. totally. Yeah. When you're in the suit, does it make you feel fat? No. Hmm. I'll show you my suit. Whoa. Anyway, sorry for me. Whoa. <laughs> no. Hey, do you guys have questions? Is there any <laughs> secret esoteric oh, power? Careful in your the construction of your nouns. Okay. You said do you guys. Do you guyses? Do you guyses have any? No, no, no. There's only one guy. No, there's several guys. Well, but you're press. Are you guys going to come on? You're press. You're no, press. He, he's a, he's a guest. A he's a guest. Okay, I'm sorry. We do have two guests. Three. Three. We have oh, three okay. official oh, attendees. God, yeah, four, I am going to slap you silly. There's those. One, three, two, three, two, three, four, have you two five, watched uh, the Super Sentai, the, the original counterpart of uh, Power Rangers? Of course. Which one do you like the most? Like, there's Zoo Ranger, which is, of course, the Mind Morphin. There is also Diamond, no. which is NPR. Kaku. Yeah. yeah. I, like, I mean, Zoo, Zoo Ranger really is, has a special part in our hearts because it was, you know, kind of the first thing. Yep. And in the recent comic they saw, there was like already like pictures that the Mind Morphin crew versus the Zoo Ranger crew is fighting each other. Wait, the Mighty Morphin crew is fighting against the Zoo Ranger crew? Yep. yep. Really? Yes. Where did you see that? Uh, it was actually in our post on in, uh, Instagram. I saw it like in an Instagram post or something like that, or I saw it like, it was in like in the Morphin Grey comic. Oh, it was a boom. It was a boom comic. Yeah. Oh, so it was like the characters from the, Ju the Japanese television show and the characters from Find the American Jap characters, yeah. Oh. Interesting. Uh, well, yeah. well, you know what? I'm going to say this. Boom Comics is single-handedly saving the Power Rangers universe by adding a little-known element called continuity. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah. They're trying to sew together decades of rampant abuse of the universe. Yeah. Yeah, the Power Rangers, I mean, unlike most superheroes, as you know, the end of the episode is like the end of the, a storyline, you know? There's no continuity, there's no sense of, hey, let's build a, a you know, universe there. I yeah. guess you already said that. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I'm going to keep drinking my coffee. Thanks for restating so, my point. Like well, let me, let me restate that. <laughs> Thank you for saying my point again. <laughs> You sound like one of the college students that you hate that you teach. Yep, no comment. The report. <laughs> I know we had some other questions. Anyone else have a question? What's up, man? Hey, we can't hear you. You need a microphone. Uh, can you hear me now? Oh no, you definitely should have a microphone. Okay. Hey, can you guys go into a little dip about that spinoff you guys almost did? Like, did you guys like shoot a pilot or anything like that? Not yeah. really. No, we didn't shoot a pilot. There was a script, and there was some concept art that involved Elvis, the Mexican Elvis, and his chihuahua. The chihuahua was involved? The chihuahua was in the script. He probably making more money than us. He was making a lot of money, and he could only work four hours a day. Really? Well, they didn't want him to get angry, because he had teeth. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah. That's funny. Well, in, in some ways, you know, that uh, when was it? The Green Ranger saga first came out on video, and they had the good, the bad, and the stupid. That was actually, in some ways, closer to a, a pilot having been shot, because they kind of used that as a sort of uh, poor man's uh, focus group. They wanted to see how well that sold. You know, it was basically just a clip show of Vulcan Skull, and it didn't sell particularly well, because I don't even know if you could buy it separately. You could. Oh, well, there you go. It was, five, it was $5. Oh. Five dollars? What, you made of money? Five dollars. 
gotcha. I was wondering how I could afford to live. Like so this. if you think about Vulcan School in the context of Power Rangers, they really were a counterpoint to the action. If you remove the action, we're not a counterpoint anymore. We are the point. And, uh, and it was not as intriguing to folks uh, uh, your age who would really like giant robots yeah. and kung fu and stuff. Yeah. There's, no, there's really very few comedy shows for children. They're always superheroes or fantasy or whatever. You know, they have some that are based on books like Curious George. Yeah, because most kids, the only jokes they get are this kind. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> You, really, subtle, you, subtle, you can't hang your hat for too long in a series on those kind of jokes, you know? Yeah. You guys were the comic relief of the show. Yeah. No shit, That's Sherlock. Yeah. <laughs> it was great. Um, do we have another question from the audience? Please. Anything. Do you guys want to know what's on the menu for lunch back there? <laughs> Little tiny sandwiches, but you'll have to get to the green room and eat them all as quickly as possible. But you're not, we're not sure what they're made of. Like yesterday, I saw somebody eating a sandwich. I'm like, hey, what's in that? They said, I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. You want one? No! <coughs> Did you see them? <coughs> they... Oh, it's a sound comfort. Oh, it's for the British ass. It's like a British thing. Yeah. yeah like, we're, we're in a manger. We fought the Nazis. All that's left is cucumbers. Yeah, bite them bread. on the meters with our cucumber sandwiches. Nice Winston nice Churchill. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible fact. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, come a two part or one. Like, uh. Did you say, wait, did you yeah. say what did you do? Terrible fat guy? Yeah. <laughs> no, I said, you're oh! a terrible fat guy. I was gonna say, he's a skinny guy. <laughs> Roosevelt. <laughs> come on, let's go. Churchill. <laughs> Roosevelt and Churchill. It's a slap. Roosevelt and Churchill on the road. <laughs> Those are pillows. Well, I'm sorry. We said I did not know. <laughs> sorry, go ahead, please. Don't let us go. That's cool. That's cool. But be fun. Like, when I first met Jason David Frank four years ago, he said that you guys act exactly like Bulk and Skull. And I was like, wow, I got to meet those two one day. <laughs> is that the first part of your two parter? No, no, the first parter is. Uh, no, that's, that was an add on. I know. Did you guys that ever write her? I don't know. a comment. Did you guys ever want to like own the character rights to Bulk and Skull? Oh, well, we kind of do. It's a, it's a good question. Uh, I don't think I'd want to pay for them because they're worthless, but I would like to own them. It's kind of like roller skates. The who? Wait a minute, wait a minute. You're going back in time, man. Don't break the fourth wall. Break the fourth wall, Caitlin. Don't break the fourth wall. Do it. Here, let me see what you got. Don't break the fourth wall. Oh yeah. Here, let me let me see. Since you've already broken the fourth wall. There's no wall. Well, we're Hey, hold on a second. Break the fourth wall. There is no wall. Look, you're here. You've already broken the wall. But it's still on the stage. These guys are very very excited that you guys are here. Me too. Hey, what's that? What's that Italian thinly sliced meat? Proscenium, they put it on. Oh, oh prosciutto? Prosciutto. prosciutto. Oh, right. Oh, man, the curtain is always smelling this place. Hey, this is great, though, right? Really what he's showing them yeah. is the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers versus the Zoo Ranger. Versus the Zoo Ranger. The Zoo Rangers really dress up. The Power Rangers walk around in you know, their teenage clothes while they're underwear. And Alpha's in the back just like raising the roof. Right like, <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the phone, man. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was like a fan okay, we, had, we did have a question. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the yeah, it was like a shit, yeah. No. Ah, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. It's still like... Yeah, it's cool. I can videotape hundreds of Power Ranger panels. Except for, I've never met Amy Jo Johnson yet. Like, she's Neither impossible. We. We've never met her. No. We don't think she's a real person. <laughs> no, she was uh, digitally added in. Like we her. think she might be an elaborate puppet. <laughs> anyway, my second... It's about a high performance... Nice area! Oh, that was a good job. Uh, Did my... you play Boys and Girls? Yeah, that's me. <laughs> you make me cry. <laughs> I'm gonna go hide my room. Oh, this one's for uh, Hyper Force. Uh, are you guys, uh, uh, yeah, people are asking if Power Morpher comes up again and show up at the Yellow Rangers panel because you are now a Ranger. Yeah, I'm a Ranger. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, think, uh, I was uh, yeah. I was, I was invited. I was invited to the Yellow Ranger oh panel God. at Morphicon, and I think I showed up, right? Did I show up? Wow, because I was there and you weren't 
Oh, I think I couldn't get there because of the enormous throng of people that were desperate to get treated like a human being by Jason Narvi and myself. What? Yeah. We had a bunch of people at our table. We couldn't go to the, I couldn't go to the LRA. I, I, we saw very, very little at that con. It was really kind of amazing. All I saw was the back of this hat. So for you guys that don't know, there is a Power Rangers con. It's called Morphin Con. Yeah, Power Morphin Con. When is it? Uh, it's every other year in August, and now, now they have a um, PMC Express, and it's coming up in uh, the second week of April. No, Correct. Second week. Yep. Time more. Yep. We're doing. We're taking it nationwide, man. We're going to be trying to go to areas where people can't necessarily get out of to come to PMC because it's so expensive to travel to California, to spend money on hotels and stuff. Um, so what do you guys have coming up? Dude, they have a lot of things. Uh, lunch? No, it's not. Oh, oh, we got, uh, Liverpool next week. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. We got this. Wow. Um, my next big job is to apologize to my wife tonight for being away the last four weekends. Yep. Uh, and I'm going to try to see my children for five minutes tomorrow. That's five minutes. So yeah. do your kids watch the show? They've seen it. I mean, I, I, I certainly kept them away from it as long as possible. <laughs> um, but they, they see it now, and they're, they're kind of getting they're kind of getting into it because it's still kind of everywhere. Okay, so here, here was a phenomenon that I realized early on. My son, when he was two years old, not even two, was obsessed with Elmo, and he had never watched Sesame Street, but he knew who Elmo was, and he wanted to have Elmo toys. And where he went, there was Elmo. And we wanted him to eat his food and say, uh, eat your taco. It's <coughs> Elmo. And he'd eat it. Which is kind of freaky and scary. And I fall at the same time. Oh, thank you. I just want to thank the Academy for... <laughs> Third place! <laughs> look at the Look at the He's like, my trophy's bigger. And the award for the best gift. How did I get it? too. Wait, which, what, what category do you win? I'm the 2019 World Series of Cosplay <laughs> Champions. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm Diecast Cars third place. Well, so you're. I'm not even in the same league. Wheels. So you're a Transformer? Wheels. I guess I'm a Transformer. Hey, you guys, I just wanted you to know that I'm the winner <laughs> of the smallest panel. There's only two people on this panel, and yet I came in third. <laughs> <laughs> She's second. Oh. oh. I'm, I'm second. Guys. Where's your trophy? I don't, I don't Do you have a trophy? Yeah. What if you guys are this the way it is? And you're like, this looks like, like a, a computer. This looks like a sword weapon. Uh, I'm just gonna my <laughs> oh, oh my god! <laughs> 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 okay guys, so we have a few minutes left. No. <laughs> um, does anybody else have one more question to ask the guys? Oh God! What are you doing? What are you laying on me? I just wanted to put my word on you. I do have one. Nice, I do have one. Uh, so, okay. Okay. what are you guys' thoughts on uh, Beast Morphers? What's that? What are you guys' thoughts on uh, Power Rangers Beast Morphers? No, I have no thoughts at all. I do. I love the helmets. The costumes are sick. What are they? Which ones are they? They're the ones that have like the visors. They look like kind of motorcycle-esque, but they're Beast Morphers. Oh. Yeah. Cute. Um, so Isn't there like only like three of them or four of them or something like Usually that? it's five because they first start out three and it starts off with the Japanese. It has three of them and then later on on the episode of the Japanese arc, gotcha. there's usually two additional characters, which is a golden silver. You, you know, it's funny. When we first did the show, we did have the kind of Bible of, of the uh, Sentai Rangers. So we would see all the different costumes. And when we first saw it, I remember saying, thinking specifically, yeah, that, that dinosaur one, the Zoo Rangers, that one will cross over to the United States. A lot of the other ones won't. And there was only like one or two others who were like, yeah, that'll work. Well, these days they use them all. Well, people, well they, they, they have it because people are they're still avoiding that train one. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh Tokyo, <laughs> Tokyo, Tokyo, sure. Yo. Uh, the one that looks like Charlie Brown, you know? Yeah, I don't, I don't like that one either. It looks, oh, it looks like, they, yeah, it looks like they all got run over by a very oh, large yeah. truck. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what was that? I don't know, Jim, let's go. <laughs> okay, are there any more questions before we play with the Bionicle figures and make them all kill each other? <laughs> no Funkos from what we are aware of. There's, there's no Funkos. There's no Funko Pops with Vulcan Skull. I want those. Right? No, 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 because 
uh, we would not receive any monetary benefit therein, and so therefore we do not support or endorse any use of our likeness for such an endeavor. I like action figures. No, I like inaction figures, totally non-posable. I like what we had. Yeah, I think I have this. Right? I used to burn Narvies in microwaves and then film that and just yep. send them the videos. Yeah, you should post the video, that's pretty cool. No, I don't want to transfer all that high eight tape <laughs> to digital. All right, well, we really appreciate you guys coming. Today. Thank you. Thank it's, you. It's time for my honor. Right. This has been the wild. Greatest one of the weekend. <laughs> Hey, just because you won the electoral college doesn't mean you're in charge. Shut up. I'm the man. My throng, we will kill you. Hey, hey boss, what are we going to do? Let's get him. Oh, no. Who are these? Where do these come from? Wait a minute. I got from a big elephant. Please, I'm a snowflake. Don't kill me. What? Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm the only I'm the <laughs> you don't play well with others, do you? <laughs> it's a oh, no. oh, 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 look at him. He's, he's crowd surfing. So what do these guys do? Uh, there's one that does a have a gear function on the back. There's usually like that one. Oh! Oh, 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 oh! Yeah, you oh, press, yeah. press the button on the over there. Oh, oh no! Oh, look. oh no! Oh, oh! He's got, he's got like a chicken. <laughs> Did I tell you about that play that was um, Hamlet and Hamlet was a chicken? No, that, that design's ripped off from Star Wars. That, that, that's, a, that's the, the Joydica design. And then he rolls and then he has a shield. Oh! Uh, oh! Oh! You punched him in the robot nuts. Oh! oh, oh. Take that, mother... <laughs> Hi, kids. <laughs> We're just doing adult things. Hey, you guys, thanks for bringing the Bionicle because all the Power Rangers toys are sold out. <laughs> Thank you guys. Oh my God. I am. I have no. no, 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 no.